Tell me you drive van 22 this morning. Your brakes are unfinished. All right, when do you think they'll be done? My afternoon's run. Oh, okay. Do you have a kindergarten run today? Yes, Riley. In fact, I do kindergarten run. Rock and Lima. Do you have any children? Well, we have a total of about uh, 60 uh, children. Two different guys, A.M. and P.M. Oh. And four of you. The two together. Check it out. And the two together, we can write off the return round. Yeah, I have about 50 on my afternoon. Oh, really? Right. Take home run. That's a few more than your last year. Right. Good morning, everybody. Well, Jimmy, ready for the morning? Yeah. Sure, I'm glad it's Friday. Yeah. You know, either the weeks are getting longer or I'm getting older. I think you're just getting older. <laughs> sure hope that blonde kid doesn't ride today. He stirs up the other kids. I got one like that. You gotta relate to him, Tony. Relate to him. Hey, listen, I've tried everything. I've listened to them. I've tried reason. You know, just last week, the noise got so bad, I pulled the bus over till they quieted down. Didn't take long, but I still caught flack from the coordinator for being late. You did the right thing. Well, the coordinator thought so, too, after I explained the whole thing to him. Sometimes we gotta relate to them in different ways, huh, Tony? <laughs> yeah, right. Hello. Hello. So, what, do we have any homework for biology yesterday? Hey, Mike! Going to the game? Oh, yeah! Maybe it'll even be good. At least it'll be good for some laughs. Right now, I've been doing so much for thinking about the bus. Just not showing up. Is it late? Who cares? Maybe the driver cracked up. Be a shame. Yeah, one of these days, that guy's gonna go right off the edge. He impresses me as the tense kind. You know, no sense of humor. <laughs> you have to educate him, Mike. Yeah, my pleasure. Please be careful with the van today. Mm-hmm. What time will your car be ready? Uh, about four this afternoon. Not hungry, Steve? No, I guess not. Man, I wish I had one more day to study. Oh, one more day and I'd have it cold. Well, you've always done well before. <laughs> but now you better think about going. It's getting late. And weren't you supposed to pick up Arlen Bill? Oh, yeah, that's right. I better go now. It'll work out OK. Yeah, I'll see you, Mom. Okay. Hey, we'll see you later, Jimmy. Thanks, Tony. I got a chem test this morning. Ooh. Is it going to be bad? Probably. Well, bluff and pray. 
Hey, sure, why not? Did you hear about that new guy, Frank Mars? No, is he cute? Oh, is he ever? Really? Mm. What grade's he in? I think it's a they water down. I saw him water down some spaghetti one time. You know, they put the sauce in. They were watering it down all really? stuff. It was all over the video tape. <laughs> well, did that like hurt you at all when you were going out to Governor's School? I don't know. I really don't. But Jerry Tanner used to work at Governor's School, and now he's at the State High. So he said he so, talked uh, to Gaddy personally. Yeah. Yeah. Well, yeah. Oh. No, I don't know. I don't think you have any problem getting here. Hello, Mr. Wiles. Morning, Dean. Morning, Mr. Wiles. Hi, Mary. Hi. Hey, Jimmy. <laughs> Howdy, Jimmy. Hey, wake up, there's Bill. Maybe you weren't gonna pick me up. Hey, it wouldn't do you the favor. Thanks a lot. How are you this morning, Arla? Okay. Except I got a million things on my mind. A million things? <laughs> That's a lot of things. You ever have a million things on your mind, Steve? Oh, well, maybe a couple hundred thousand, but never a million. You guys are real cute. Well, that's what I keep telling you, Arla. We're sweet, too. And you're just morons. Hey, come on, Arla. Don't get touchy. Yeah. Go to buy some Mike. What's he doing? Come on. Close that door. Close it now. Hey, come on. He's almost in. Yeah, big deal. Let him in. You come around to the front and close that door. You two, up here. Come on. Hold it right there. You sit there, and you, right there. You get in here. Hey, come on, Mike. Hey, Mike, how's it going? What's happening, man? Hold it. You are sitting in the back. Gets me. He should have retired during the Crusades. He's been here forever. My mother had him. He must be at least 117. I heard he was 70. You know, 65 is supposed to be the mandatory retirement age. Yeah, but I think they can make exceptions. Portman's an exception, all right. Are we ever going to get there? Talk about slow. Hey! The driver's doing his best. Have faith in his driver, man. <laughs> Catch the way he freaked out on the door. Yeah, that buzz really made him jump. <laughs> Six feet high. <laughs> hey, 
Hey, Steve, guess who's coming up behind us? Isn't that Linda Jenkins? Yeah. Don't strain Ooh. your necks too hard. Wee. Don't worry. Hey, what's she doing? She's all right. We're the ones that missed the turn. Hey, Linda, come back. It wasn't your fault, Jimmy. I was really watching. I know that intersection's bad and my eyes are on the road. But that buzzer, Tony, that damn buzzer. It was only a second. One lousy second. Thank you. 